at Gordon Ramsay. The portion is small, but what do you think? Gordon Ramsay, the savage guy he is, he actually replied to this. John, your rice looks older than me. Is this real life right now? Okay, looking at that, that is so damn true. And is this guy on a major diet? Because where's all the food at? And is that chunks of butter in your rice? And by the way, did you guys even notice the time the message was sent at? John tweeted at 422 in the morning, and Gordon Ramsay woke up hella early that morning and replied at 555 in the morning. I wonder if Gordon Ramsay is ever in a good mood. So, the food was shocking. Hello, Pa. Disgusting, dated well, how's it going you guys? I'm your host for this one, Landon Do Not Sing, and welcome back to a brand new video here on Most Amazing Top 10. We are closing in on 5 million subscribers, so if you guys aren't already subscribed here, if you guys aren't already a part of the Most Amazing Family here, hit the subscribe button, what the heck are you waiting for? And I'm not sure why we ever stopped this series over a year ago, but I like really funny and dumb stuff, so I'm like, yo, we're gonna bring this back. So let's not waste any time with this one, let's get right into what you guys clicked for this is the top 10 funniest tweets part 8 if you guys want part 9 put in the comment section below part 9 and we can continue this series on and also don't forget to hit the like button alright let's start off this video in at number 10 my dentist asked his assistant to suction the water out of my mouth but I thought he was talking about me so I sucked on his finger <laughs> I'm mortified I would be way too embarrassed even to like if that happened to me I would not tweet that situation out I wonder what the doctor was thinking when Sarah started sucking on her finger. That could have easily been taken in like the wrong way. Like the, it could have been like a dirty situation or maybe he enjoyed it and gave her like a 50% discount on her filling. I, I don't know. Dear God, uh, just imagine doing that. I don't know if you've ever been in like a situation I can't situation imagine doing like, that. Uh, He's got his gloves on and everything. You're just sucking yeah, on them. Yeah, it's like, please. And I, uh, oh why, would he, why would he ask to do that? In what situation would he ask for why my Why would that ever be, be okay? That's like another level of fear for going to the dentist. Don't suck on their finger. <laughs> another level of fear. <laughs> like, I also get the thought process of like, please suck this. And you're like, well, you're clearly doing something with my mouth and I'm going to trust you as an authoritative figure. But like, I really, like, I, if, I feel If the like, dentist says suck on it, you do it? If they're like that, I would have a moment of like, do I, do I? But like then immediately realize it's wrong. And I feel like this person like realized how wrong it was after they're like, oh, fuck. and then what, what do you do? You have to go through with it. What do you like? I mean, that's so tough. What would you do if you like, you got to the point where you're I like. I would suck on it. <laughs> Moving into number nine, at Gordon Ramsay. Oh man, this is gonna be a good one. Slaved over this for hours. How's my dinner looking, Mr. Ramsay? Gordon Ramsay replied with, congratulations. I've never seen eggs that dry. I'm not sure if I'm concerned about the weak old eggs or if I'm concerned for people who put pineapple on their ham. I mean, why do people do that? It just ruins the meal. And especially if you're adding peas to it. Congratulations, I've never seen eggs that dry. Aw, that's kind of mean. I think it looks quite nice. That, look, that does not look nice. Uh, that's a classic British dinner. That's gammon egg and chips, mate. Yeah, but if you dip into that, that's not like, like spilling out. That's what your ketchup's for. Oh, man. Oh, I thought the eggs looked nice. <laughs> <laughs> Why are British people thinking the eggs look good? The eggs look great. No. They really nailed the consistency. It also looks like if you put a knife in it, a little bit would ooze. I don't like when it all oozes. That's the thing. There's no oozing in, that, in those eggs. I also, the only thing that offends me on this plate is the pineapple. Hey, that's what I said. <laughs> <laughs> Number eight, McDonald's. Black Friday. Need copy of Link. Wendy's. Wendy's replied, when the tweets are as broken as the ice cream machine. Wendy is so savage, but they know the truth. I mean, how is every single damn ice cream machine in the world broken? Like, they they'll break after seven. When the tweets was broken as the ice cream machine. Is there right. ever, is there, was there ever a time the machine wasn't broken? Every time. Every time, Without Why? fail. I don't think they even have a machine. Yeah. <laughs> They're just like, oh no, 10 years ago we had a machine and then we stopped making them. And now people are still asking for this ice cream. I mean, the first one was just funny by itself. Like, some intern obviously was like left in charge of the Twitter account. And they just tweeted out neat copy of me. Oh my god. That's amazing. <clears throat> Moving into number seven, 1998. In 20 years, we'll have flying cars. 2018, we literally have to tell people to not eat Tide Pods. I'm pretty sure we got dumber as time went on. I mean, what the heck is wrong with us? And I'm pretty sure Tide Pods actually had to make commercials now saying that Tide Pods are not edible. Which is what I want to talk to you about today. You gotta stop eating the Tide Pods, okay? Look. I get it. You guys are young. You're hip. You don't want an old guy telling you what to do. 
But Tide Pods are soap, and that's not food. We literally have to tell people not to eat Tide Pods. It's true. Honestly, I thought we would do better, but we didn't. And I'm sorry to past me. Yeah, we didn't succeed with the flying curves. <laughs> Elon, get on it. Oh, man, <laughs> society. <laughs> I mean, I personally feel great about civilization. Um, I, I don't. <laughs> <laughs> no hope. I, I was being sarcastic, Landon. <laughs> We're all doomed. You're being, you're being optimistic. All doomed. We'll never have flying cars. We don't deserve flying cars. You don't think we deserve it? No. Man. If we're eating Tide Pods, no. <laughs> yeah, true. <laughs> all right, number six. My boyfriend cheated on me, so I convinced him to get matching tattoos. He went first, and then I went home. Okay, I wonder what the tattoo was. Hopefully it was like the worst tattoo ever you convinced him to get like something just so stupid and hopefully he was in a lot of pain while getting that tattoo let's go sir yes let's go ow no that freaking hurts there's blood on me Here. moving into number five lawyer did your boyfriend commit the crime girlfriend honey he can't even commit to this relationship. Entire jury. Oh, snap. Entire jury. Oh, snap. <laughs> <laughs> What's the crime? Yeah, <laughs> That's what I want to know. Oh, that is hilarious. <laughs> oh, snap. Jury. Oh, snap. <laughs> wow. Yeah. That's, 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 that's close to home. <clears throat> Number four. Gina's got some thoughts. She says, I want to go on a date with Wendy's and take them to a real burger joint at Burger King. Then Burger King replied with, treat her like the princess she deserves to be. Wendy's, if you're looking for a princess, you might want to let it go. Not interested in the frozen beef kingdom. Wendy's seems to have so many savage tweets. I mean, who the heck is running their Twitter account? It's so good. It's so good. Hey guys, it's Wendy here. I'm going to be going around to all the different fast food restaurants today to let you know why we are the best and everyone else is trash. Number three, do you ever want to take a nap, but the nap doesn't want to take you? I'm not even sure kids have a problem with this. I know I do. You want to go for a nap and you just can't sleep no matter how tired you feel. The nap doesn't want to take you. Well, kids, well, they, they seem to fall asleep anywhere. Bodhi sleeping while standing after skiing. He, he is a sound asleep. I always want a nap. I actually can't nap. I sleep. When I try to nap, <laughs> yeah. I wake up 10 hours later <laughs> and I don't know where I am. <laughs> Number two, cop. You're driving on the wrong side of the road. Driver, sorry, I'm English. Cop, it's the wrong side of the road you're driving on, isn't it? Okay, I, I screwed that up. I'll, I'll, let me redo that. It's the wrong side of the road you drive. You, you was driving down. <laughs> I can't do it. Okay, let's 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 see how the British people. Let's see how this is actually supposed to be said. It's the wrong side of the road you was driving <laughs> down, in it. <laughs> Cop, you're driving on the wrong side of the road. Driver, sorry, I'm English. Cop, shouting, it's the wrong side of the road you was driving down, in it. <laughs> that was actually pretty good. That wasn't too bad. <laughs> I think Lucy would be pretty proud of that. <laughs> it's the wrong side of the road you was driving down in it. <laughs> I like how they, yeah, yeah, that's a pretty good way of writing out the accent. I'll give them that. <laughs> driving down. Finally, number one, of course we have another Wendy's funny savage moment. I had to save them for number one. It's 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 so good. Tony, so at Wendy's, you just get a let at IHOP. Remember when they changed IHOP to IHOP? So Wendy's, you just get a let IHOP sell burgers on your block. I thought you were the OG. Wendy's, I'm not really afraid of the burger place that decided pancakes were too hard. So Wendy's, you're just gonna let IHOP sell burgers on your block? I thought you were the OG. <laughs> Wendy's not really afraid of the burgers from a place that decided pancakes were too hard. <laughs> Wendy's are fire. They're savage. Wendy's I are love it. Absolutely <laughs> savage. Good job whoever's running their social accounts. Wendy's. I suppose if you're doing so badly as a corporation, you've got to kind of give it on the social media, haven't you? Are they doing bad? Is Wendy's doing bad? Uh, when was the last time you went to Wendy's? Yeah, true. <laughs> <laughs> true, yeah. Is it, that's what they did. That's so sad. I loved IHOP when it was IHOP. I, I don't respect IHOP. Is it, what is it right now? Is IHOP. It, I, is it actually IHOP? I think they switched back to IHOP. And it might- they, I don't know, we need to look this up. I thought it was IHOP. <laughs> IHOP. 
Well, they switched it? it to high, high hop, but I think it was like a, a promotional thing. I think they switched it back. It's a pro promotional thing? I don't even know if they actually did it. Do they still sell pancakes? I don't know. I don't know what they Is do. Is it just burgers? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. We've got Hayley Googling this. Yeah, they did change the name back they changed it. IHOP. They changed it back to IHOP. What? They changed it back again? They changed it back. Maybe after that tweet. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. What caused it? Like, yeah. ooh, ouch. Yeah. Well, thank you guys so much for watching this video. This video was a whole lot of fun. I hope you guys want part nine. Let me know in the comment section below. But that's it for me, guys. I will see you guys all in the next Most Amazing Top 10 video. So, Wendy's, you just gonna let IHOP sell burgers on your block? Is it IHOP? IHOP. What's IHOP? Yeah, they changed it. Did you know that? No. They changed it. But I don't know if they permanently change it. It's confusing. What? IHOP's not a thing now. It's, it's called it's just IHOP. IHOP. Yeah. And it's just burgers. They just switch from package to burgers. <laughs> yeah. Really? All right, IHOP. Okay, we'll start again. <laughs> How did you say it? Oh man, it's the wrong it's the wrong side of the road. You're driving down in it. Is, Wait, that, is that Australian? <laughs> so where are you from? <laughs> yeah. yeah, I think that's closer to Australia. Cops like you're not from the UK. <laughs> no one knows from where you're from. <laughs> 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 She has another one. It's all about me. Yeah, I know. Uh, like am I in this more than London? <laughs> 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 <laughs>